Hello everyone, welcome back in today's tutorial on Unix. In today's tutorial, we are going to learn how to access the manual or the help page in Unix shell. Whenever we do programming using Unix shells, sometimes we need to understand what commands are meant for so that we can it's it's a full power and write a very strong program. So the man or help page it it provides various informations about each and every command. So what is man pages? Unix versions of the help files are called man pages. For example, if you are searching for particular word or definition of particular word, what do you do? We normally go to the Google or any search engine and search that word and get the meaning. Or you can go to the wiki page and you search for the meaning and more details. On the same line, Unix maintains this man pages. Man is a very straightforward command. You have to type man and give the command name after that. It will give you the information. What that information contains? It contains what is the name of that command, the synopsis, which will give the general usage parameters of the given command. <clears throat> it will also provide some description how to use that and other related properties. Of course, we get the options also. It describes all the arguments or the options with the command. Some of them are mandatory arguments and some of them are optional. If there are related commands also present, then those will be also mentioned in also sections where we can refer also section for the more details. If there are any bugs present in the given command or the team might be working on those bugs, those are listed in the bug section which explains what are the known issues or the bugs that exist with the current command. The sample examples are also mentioned in the sample sections and the more interesting is the author details are also mentioned in the author section of this page. Now how can we access? So we'll see those things in this demo. So we are at the Unix console and you can just type the man command and suppose if I enter, uh, if I press an enter button, it says what manual page do you want? So this is come, this output is coming from the that help page or the manual page. Now suppose I want a manual page for grip command. So you can just type the grip command and hit the enter button. So as I mentioned, it provides the several sections such as name, synopsis, description, etc. In the name section, it will see what are the grip commands available and for which we have these details available. The commands such as grip, egrip, and fgrip, these are the commands available in our help page. The synopsis will give you what are the mandatory and what are the optional parameters. So if, if you see here, the grip optional and then it provides the patterns and then file. We can use the options such as hyphen E and hyphen F as well. The description section provides what this grip command is about. If you read the first line, it says grip searches the named input files for the lines containing a match to the given pattern. And that's the reason we have to provide some pattern to search. The other options or other details for hyphen E and hyphen F are also explained in the paragraph second. If you want to know the more details about this command, you can just press the down key or the enter button. It will provide what options available with the grip command. For example, the options such as hyphen hyphen help, hyphen capital V, hyphen E, hyphen F, and there are so on options available with the explanation what these options are meant for. So this is robust explanation is already available on this help page. 
I would like to show some some other interesting aspect. Of course, we have the regular expression also, which we can use for the grape and environment variables also we can grab and that those are the commands those are the options available as i said earlier um, it provides the section called as a box if there is any issue reported for this grab command those will be documented in this box sections for example for the grab command there are reported messages are reporting bugs email bugs reported this is the organization and the details about this bug what is the known bug the large repetition counts in the n and m construct may cause grep to use lots of memory so memory issue is reported for this grep command so this is for additional information apart from that it also tells us c for the regular manual pages for commands such as awk cpm diff etc an additional posix programmers manual page and text in text info documentation there are some notes also available which comes under the c also sections if there is specific author is there for this command then that will be documented under the author section for now we don't have author for this command at the bottom if you see it says press h for help or q to quit if i press just q button i will go back to the back screen let's search for the next command man for ls that is a list command which will list the files so name is list it's a list of directory contents synopsis is list ls options and then file name of course we can use expression also that layer we have the description sections for the list command <coughs> apart from this various options available for the list command we have the sections such as author and we can see here the author name written by richard and david we have the copyright also copyright is 2013 free software foundation inc and the other details about the copyright as like the grep command we have the c also section for this ls command which provide the further information what we need to look for let me do the q and i'll go back if you want to see um any random word like abc xyz can i do the manual on this page and just if i want to do something random it will give the entry such as no manual entry for this given word so if if there is if there is no information present in this help pages we'll get something like this message even if you try to provide like manual sorry uh even if you provide manual c if you might think z is a kind of command and if you want to provide you will get something like this message no manual entry for z so this manual help or the help in the unix will be available or will be provided in this console only if that is captured as a page or is captured as a help page this tutorial we saw the various sections um available for the help so and this is this provides very helpful information what command is what options available also it provides what uh the description about that given command another else like suppose do the man hyphen help hyphen help so what do you see so we can say if whenever we use hyphen hyphen help which is kind of the help page which provide the what options we can use with this given command so man it's a it's a itself is an command if you want to know what options i can use with man command then i can use hyphen hyphen help it provide the usage man options and the sections and the page you can provide what are the option minus c minus d etc thus the, the in case of the man grip 
we provided the page name that is the grape is a page itself so pages are maintained as a, as per the commands if you have the various commands those command nothing but the pages and the help associated with it it's provided whenever you call the man command of course you can develop your own manual and the manual uh, sections if you are developing any custom script or you can use this inbuilt manual help also let's clear it out and suppose if you do like manual for help or let me give it out or if you do manual dot command if you notice the both the command man dot help man help and man command for the both the commands it is giving the same page and this is nothing but the information about this the man command so it gives the what it contains the information for man name bash bulletin commands and other informations such as binding break etc so if you are like if you would like to know about the manual or what it information contains you can access directly by using the command or the help the other manual commands we already saw for grep list uh, you can similarly do for the other commands too i hope this tutorial is helpful for you guys if you have any questions or queries you can definitely mention in the comment uh, com comment section of this video do not forget to subscribe my channel for more interesting updates about unix thank you have a nice time